What is going on guys? My name is Ramba back in from our reviews here. Please ignore my hair. Yes, I would love to get a hair. I would love to get a haircut, but as you guys know, it's things are slightly locked down right now. <laughs> but what is going on guys? It's Ramba back in from our reviews here with another episode reaction to Kaguya-sama Love is War episode 3, 4 of season 2. <laughs> it's been a long day. I just got back home from work. I'm still working. Thankfully, in this uh, craziness, but, and that is also why I'm a little bit late, otherwise I would have had this up multiple hours ago. Uh, but yeah, um, this is going to be where things start getting uh, interesting once again. As you guys know, in the last episode, we got to see Miyuki, Shiragane, and the rest of the student council disband. For now. At the end, we got to see Shiragane turn in a slip that he actually wants to, at least, go on and continue with... Uh, the student council position as the president. Um, but here's where things get interesting. I'm not gonna try. I'm gonna try really hard not to spoil things. But we're gonna be getting a character that we saw at the end of the first season, and it was also been teased throughout this entirety with the opening, and that would be Miko. Uh, now, for some reason, I keep on saying me thinking it's Mika. I don't know why. I just for some or Maki. I keep on seeing that Maki. She just looks like a Maki, but it's Miko. Uh, and this episode is called Aya Hayasaka Wants Him to Fall for Her. I'm trying to remember what chapter that is. By the way, Hayasaka is best girl. Don't at me. If you guys have read the manga, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Kaguya wants to be confessed to. That's literally just th the show. <laughs> and Miko Ino wants to set things right. Now, Miko is a very interesting character. I want to see what the fandom reacts to her for people who are not uh, familiar with her in general. But this, like I've said multiple times, this is probably one of my favorite shows of recent years, um, this series. Um, definitely by far in terms of just uh, enjoyment in a comedy series, and I can't relate, uh, and I can't recommend this enough. Also, I know some people have been asking where I get my shows. Um, if you're watching this to watch the show, I wouldn't recommend it because, as, as you guys can see, I'm doing this. Uh, this is mainly for people who want to watch along with the show with me, if they can bring it up on another's page, or if they've already seen a scene and want to watch along with me because they want to see my reaction to a certain thing. Um, this is not really a channel for watching a show so you can watch in the first place uh that's not what this channel is for um and i can understand why some people would like to see it but unfortunately that's not what this channel is um and just due to copyright issues issues as well um if you want to go find this episode i'm or the series i'm pretty sure you can find it anywhere online it's fair I, i'm pretty sure i could look it up on multiple third-party sites, um, but me, myself, I legally pay for it through Funimation, which is the only company, I believe, that has the rights to it. Last year, I believe, Crunchyroll had it. Um, and so, if I can, I always will watch things legally, uh, and on the rare occasion that I can't, I, I will do what I must. Um, but thankfully, I, usually most of the shows that I watch are usually covered by either Funimation or Crunchyroll, sometimes High Dive, but... It is what it is. But anyways, guys, enough rambling on. Let's get into this episode. Without further ado, let's start in three, two, three, two, one. Let's jam. And he plicks. Let me turn up the volume just slightly. It's a little up. That should be fine. Doom. All right, I'm trying to. For, I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to remember where what happens on this one. And Kage is dying. Justice for Hayasaka. We actually did finally get justice for Hayasaka. Last, literally the last chapter. <laughs> Because, despite them being both geniuses, they are both fucking idiots. <laughs> mm-hmm. 
<laughs> oh. <laughs> Okay, I think I remember how this episode continues. I'm not entirely sure, though. Opening one's still better, don't at me. But this is fantastic, too. Ba-ba-da, ba-ba-da, ba-ba-da. One, two, three. <laughs> This show makes me happy. This show just makes me happy. Oh, man. But yeah. Hayasaka is just so good. Most of the girls. I wouldn't say all the girls. It's not like a... um. It's not like a Persona 5 situation where they're not like... Where at least like... Where every girl is fucking great. I don't know, I'm still not convinced on Miko myself. <laughs> and I've known her for like, what, 90, 80, 80, 90 chapters probably? I don't know. I need to figure out when they introduced her and where we are and then compare them like how long I've actually known Miko. But yeah, I am, I'm really curious to see how the anime fandom reacts to Miko for this. You know, I'm still, like, really curious as about Hayasaka in general. Like, I'm wondering what's going to happen now in the manga. I'm super curious. <laughs> For the masses? I love how they're giving like this kind of like poppy kind of music to her. It really as as it works as she is right here. Not me. I was a dick. I was a dick as a kid. Like, hey, son, where do you put your shit? I'm like, there. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Yeah. I see a bobblehead. I never noticed she chewed this straw. <laughs> oh man, there's a voice acting. Oh, perfect. No. You underestimate the president's power. <laughs> hey, watching things get crushed. Oh my god, I can't believe Kagi is fucking dead. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
But have you asked? <laughs> oh, man. I will never, ever, ever. <laughs> I will never snot praise A1 Pictures for doing a fantastic job at doing at, at um adapting this. It's so good. It's one of the few times I'm like, yep, this dub is just so goddamn good. But that was a lie. Oh, she's far from defenseless. <laughs> oh, praise the narrator, too. Nani? Justice for Hayasaka. <laughs> oh, I remember. Hayasaka Ah <laughs> Oh man Oh man Hayasaka just It's basically a muggle. I love the shots of the eyes. They've always that's always been a staple ever since the first season. <laughs> oh, you actually managed to make to make her upset. That voice. Oh my god. Misunderstandings. <laughs> They're playing this music again.
<laughs> oh my gosh, what's her name? Isn't it Maki? Isn't that Maki? I totally forgot. <laughs> <That got fucking nuts. laughs> this just in. Oh my gosh, she's all flustered. And everyone is like... Jesus Christ. Although, funny thing is, this one actually increases uh, his, <laughs> his, his social standings. <laughs> and Chica's like totally in on it. <laughs> Chica picking up on a vibe? No. Not sub actually subject after yes. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna get fucked up. Somewhere private. Good. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> That's cheating. You can't do that to me. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I love the show so goddamn much. I forgot how this ends. I don't remember how this ends. You fucking bitch. <laughs> okay, you know... <sighs> I'm fucking dead. Miko is in here. Eno. I'm gonna call it Eno because it makes it more... It clarifies things a lot better. <laughs> oh my god. Miyuki, I know you're confident. 
or egotistical, but goddamn. That's a good point. <laughs> That's putting it lightly. I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Like uh, for the manga readers, is there anyone who actually like thinks that you know is best girl, like legitimately? Like, I, I love her character, like, especially later on after you've got de de development from her. It's been a minute. It's been a while. I'm finally glad we get to get introduced to her. Yeah, I remember she's part of the morals committee. I totally forgot her father was a judge, which makes sense. I don't, yet, yeah, sorry, 147. Um, 147 centimeters. Sorry, I'm, I'm American, so, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Forehead Sean. I don't remember her name much. She's not too prevalent, especially lately. Like, she's in backgrounds, but, like, she does not have a, much of a presence. At least in recent chapters. <laughs> Wait. They're not going to do a reference, are they? Okay, no. Hold on. It, it... I see people standing on top of a cliff, looking down at people... I immediately jump to Jojo. I thought I said <laughs> You're just getting scouted right in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> oh no I <laughs> look at that bashfulness <laughs> average I don't I don't really remember much. I don't really remember much about her playing piano. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> like I like Maki. Miko, god damn it, I know. Traitor. 
So, in order to get in good favor with Chica, just praise her. Say her bow's cute. I don't fucking know. Yeah, I like. I understand that viewpoint. I really do. It makes a lot of sense. <laughs> I know, right? Like, I like, wasn't really part of it. Hold on. <laughs> and ending. All right. Um. Yeah, like that wouldn't really work, especially nowadays age, because. Kids are rebellious. I mean, yes, this is a whole different situation because these are uh, snooty rich kids. Um, but this, it, it wouldn't, it would never fly. I forgot she does s slight spoilers in the next maybe episode. Um, she does do something to like get favor back, but it's like nowhere like that's like. I don't think it's like ever becomes like an actual thing, um, like. I think it's like a slight threat at first, but that's about it. Um, but yeah, honestly, I this was really good. Uh, last episode still was probably my favorite episode um, of this season. Because when Ishigami was getting fucking beat up by uh, Chika, it was probably one of the funniest things I've ever seen in my life. But yeah. Hayasaka deserves to be loved. I'm yeah, and I'm really curious as to see how that would happen. What happens with her? I hope she gets a little. A little I mean, she got just pure screen time on this, but I hope she gets more with how she is now. Not gonna really spoil things, but for those in the, who've read the manga, yeah. No credit scene. All right. Um, it was kind of funny though. I think one of uh, some someone on Twitter, I think it was like might have been one of the production companies, posted something like an ending. It, it looked like it would be the equivalent of like because it, it was all about Chica. So I thought it was gonna be like the next Chica dance, which is kind of funny though because I believe last season it was episode three that they changed the ending for the Chica dance that that became synonymous and super famous for a good reason. Um, so I thought that was what it was going to be. I actually didn't watch it. I only saw, like, the first few seconds before I stopped it because I thought it was actually going to be at the end here. Um, but no, we actually did not get that. So I'm wondering if that might have been just, like, some type of animation purely used to promote the Blu-rays and DVDs. Kind of like what they did, but they didn't show it. So maybe they'll have it next week, but they posted it right after, I believe, the episode went live for Western audiences because... Um, usually this comes at around 8-ish, uh, Pacific Standard Time, so, like, 11 Eastern Standard Time, or, in, in America's time zone, but, I, I, it's just kind of odd, just kind of odd. Wonder why. I, I might watch it, I don't know. I'll, tr I'll, I'll have to check it out, though. But anyways, guys, what do you guys think of the episode? Let me know what you guys are in the comment section below. Um, again, I do apologize. If I should wear a hat, let me know. If you're like, oh, God, Roman, what's with that hair? It looks like ass. I, I don't blame you, and I hate it too, but it is what it is. Normally, this is a lot shorter. I know some people think, oh, that's not that long. This is long for me, okay? Especially the back of my hair. It's starting to get, it's starting to get like, curly, and I don't like it because when my hair grows out after a certain point, it starts getting curly, and not a fan. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below, and I will see you guys next week. See ya.